Hi, today I'm going to talk about how to create a solid work macros uh, using C sharp language. First of all, you need to install two software. Okay, let's go there. The first one is uh, VSTA. Uh, it's called Microsoft Visual Studio Tool for applications. Just type in VSTA download in Google and uh, click the link. Yeah, it will bring to you bring you to the download page. Just click the red button, uh, title the download, and uh, install it. All right. The second one is the Visual Studio 2015 community. Again, just type in Visual Studio 2015 community download and uh, click the link. And check the Visual Studio 2015 update 3. And find the one with the community here. Visual Studio community 2015 with update 3, all right? And uh, download it and install it, and uh, you'll be ready to go, okay? It's back to the SolidWorks. First of all, we are going to uh, create a new part document. We are going to record the process of create a cylinder, and uh, take a look at the C-sharp project file, okay? First of all, just click the record, then select the top plane, go to the sketch mode, and uh, select the circle, all right? Just create a, in a circle with random radius, all right? Finish the circle and extrude the circle. We can type in, yeah, our 30, yeah. All right, finish the cylinder. Now we can stop the macro. Okay, the V the Sari will ask you to say give the name for the C sharp project. Just remember, uh, in this type you need to select C sharp. Okay, here, yeah, we can choose like a, a demo two. All right. Save it. Okay, now we can open the demo too. Again, just remember you need to select here in the C sharp type. Okay. All right. Here the process. Uh, of creating a cylinder using C sharp language, as you can see, select the type, top plane, and uh, create a circle, and extrude uh, 30 millimeter. Uh, one of the advantages of uh, using C sharp is the variable is declared by the exact type. For example, the the SWDOC is declared by model DOC2. So we know the exact type of this variable. In VBA, uh, usually uh, WDOC is declared as like uh, object. Uh, that's a very general uh, variable type. So we don't know exactly what kind of variable it is. So we cannot use it, the, the members uh, until we find the type for it. Yeah, that's the advantage of Shisha. Another thing to, to, uh, we need to know is uh, traditionally in Shisha project, we need to build before we can run it. Yeah, even after we modify the source code, we need to build it uh, before we run it. But here, uh, for the SolidWorks uh, script file, we don't really need to do that. All we need to do is just modify them and run. Okay, let's demo it. Here, the height is 30 millimeter. Let's change it to uh, 10 millimeter. 
and go back to starting work and let's close this one okay again create a new part document okay let's go back to the okay here we didn't build it right we just start and run it okay. right it's done so here yeah here is a cylinder with the 10 millimeters yep uh, this is the end of the video all right